This is the biggest bass I've caught in a while. It's a good one. What's up guys? Today we're at Gander Outdoors. Uh, uh, some of you know Gander Mountain closed down and uh, someone else bought them and they changed their name to Gander Outdoors. So there's one up here in Ocala and I was driving by it. Never been to it so we're going to check it out together. I'm uh, filming on my phone so hopefully I won't get kicked out or banned like Cabela's because I might actually like this place. Alright, catch when we get inside. Looks like you got a good selection of kayaks in here. I don't know anything about kayaks, so I'm not a kayak angler. So far, it looks about the same. Do we see? Got all the camo in here. So, uh, fishing stuff, they got your own normal selection like jigs and stuff right here for crop and stuff. They got my favorite color for Chad. Yamamoto, Senkos, I got Senkos, Trick Rings. Zoom. I got all your hooks here. Worm hooks. Alright guys, I don't know how much I showed you in there, but um, yeah, it's basically like uh, Gander Outdoors used to be. They have all the fishing stuff, saltwater, freshwater, camping stuff. They have a lot more kayaks and stuff than Gander Mountain did. They got all the guns and stuff, but I don't want to film guns because you know how it went in the other video at Cabela's. I got banned. So, 
I should skip to that part, filmed a little bit of the fishing stuff, but it looks like a pretty good store and they're opening a ton of them, like, it's supposed to open like 200 or something, so hopefully we'll get some more around here because it looks like it's pretty good. Prices seem decent. It's like, it feels like Academy Sports, which um, I'm, I've done one video there and I love that place. They always have a clearance rack, Lojo Fishing, he's always doing stuff there. So, um, yep, catch you on next episode of Bass T-Redfish. Thank <laughs> you.